The Lotus Effect was inspired scientists and designers to revolutionize the textile industry. Nanotechnology contributes commercial rebirth of Lotus-inspired superhydrophobic products in the global market. Thanks to nanotechnology, we wear less polluting clothes and use garments which are no need to wash. Water drops on lotus leaves are seen as droplets, not absorbed. The term lotus effect refers to hydrophobic water repellency and self-cleaning. In general, surface wetting causes adhesive force at the contact between the liquid and the surface. But on lotus leaves, this general sense seems doesn't work. On lotus leaves, water droplets look almost spherical. The sphere has a minimum surface area, and it minimizes solid liquid surface energy. There seems no adhesion between the water droplet and the surface. That is because the surface of a lotus leaf doesn't wet. The wax coating repels water on the surface of the lotus leaves and keeps them from getting wet. Then why do scientists call it self-cleaning? Water droplets pick up dirt particles from lotus leaves. The adhesion between dirt particles and the water droplet is higher than that between particles and surfaces. Therefore, when water droplets roll across hydrophobic surfaces such as lotus leaves, they become removed from the surface. Until now, similar effects of superhydrophobicity and self-cleaning have been observed in around 200 different plant species. The lotus effect has a significant impact on the commercialization of products due to its multiple advantages. This effect has been utilized in various surfaces, including wood, plastic, glass, metal, and stone, including absorbers and fibers. It is also used as a powerful insulator for electronic devices to prevent electrical damages by accidental contact with water. Other uses include preventing water condensation and ice formation in extreme climates on the surface of cars, ships, and airplanes. We can live our fantasies.